My name is Ghulam Abbas. I'm the director of Minimally Invasive Thoracic Surgery at Meridian Health. We're talking about Barrett esophagus. As we know that 20 to 23 million US population has reflux symptoms. And we know that patients who have reflux disease, which is also known as GERD or heartburn, 10% of these patients will have a Barrett esophagus. What happened in reflux patients over the years, the acid and bile damages the lower part of the esophagus and the lining changes to a pre-malignant, which is a precursor to cancer. It's called Barrett esophagus. We know that once you have Barrett esophagus, chances of developing esophageal cancer is 110 to 2200 times higher as compared to the patients who does not have a Barrett esophagus. That depends what stage of Barrett esophagus you have. Till recently, we didn't have a good solution for the management of Barrett esophagus. Now we have a very unique and innovative approach for the treatment of Barrett esophagus, which is done endoscopically and is done as an outpatient basis. We, we endoscopically, we place a balloon with copper wiring or a plate with copper wiring on, in the esophagus and burn the lining of the esophagus. The body produces normal lining after the treatment. Usually it takes two to three treatment at two months apart uh, for complete eradication of the Barrett esophagus. It works in more than 90% of the patients. It is done as an outpatient. Patients go home same day and they are usually on liquid diet for a day or two and then they start their regular diet. Here at Meridian Health, we have a very comprehensive program in place for the diagnosis and management of esophageal diseases, including Barrett esophagus, where we perform radiofrequency ablation using Barrett's system endoscopically on an outpatient basis.